What's going on guys? Pete out here with a quick video on how to install the audio drivers uh, necessary to use any of the RAIN hardware or Pioneer DJM900 SRT or Pioneer DDJ SZ mixer and controller for Serato DJ. Previously for Serato Scratch Live, um, Serato made it pretty easy and asked you which hardware you're going to use it with and uh, installed these drivers in the installation process. Uh, but with Serato DJ, Serato left this out, uh, which made the install a little bit faster, uh, but kind of hid the uh, the drivers needed. So here's how to do it. What you're going to want to do is either two finger click on a Mac, or hold down uh, Control and go to Show Package Contents. Once that's open, you're going to want to go to the Contents folder, Resources, Packages and you're going to see all of these installers. <clears throat> now each of these installers is the driver needed for each of these devices. So if you're going to be using any of the rain boxes, which are down here, or uh, any of the rain mixers, uh, you're going to want to install these as well as the, the Pioneer mixers. Some people, you know, are only using an SL4 or run into a Rain 62 in a club or a DJM, but uh, keep it safe. Uh, I would just go ahead and install all of these. Now, fair warning, every time you install one of these, uh, the computer is going to ask you to, or the installer, I should say, is going to ask you to restart. So this process, if uh, depending on the driver, it can take anywhere to one to f maybe three or four minutes each. So, you know, if you have like a half hour um, of time for your gigs, just go ahead and try to install all these. But if you're in a pinch and, you know, maybe you just installed Serato DJ, you can just go ahead and install the one driver you need uh, with the hardware you're using that, that night or for your gig. So again, you just double click on this, the installer would open up, and then you would just go ahead and uh, go through the installation process. Then your computer will restart, then all you got to do is click on Serato DJ and you'll be good to go. Alright, thanks guys, I hope that helped out. If you have any questions or comments, please leave those below. Uh, remember to like and subscribe, uh, new content comes out every Monday. And if you have any suggestions for future tutorials, please leave those in the comments below, and I'll try to respond as quickly as possible and get those up for you. All right, thank you again.